Hi everybody, welcome back. This is Donna from Many Aprons and this is part three. Hopefully it's the end, <laughs> but as you can see, we are ready to go. And now we're going to decorate this. Now, like I said, I usually get um, vines. I get uh, things from people that don't want them or rummage sales. And I just get stuff and I tear them apart. And, you know, like this vine here was where I got all this. Now, I wouldn't mind putting these red flowers on there, but I think they're going to be too much. Maybe. I don't know. What do you think? But um, I might just take them off. We might stick a couple of them in there. I don't know. But <clears throat> I am... Um, oh. So that's what I do. I go around. I look for things that people are in the rummage sales. And, I mean, too expensive at the, at the other stuff just to have a, a, a hobby. So I two, took two of the vines and I twisted them. Now I have my glue, hot glue going. And, oops, let me shut this off. And... We're going to, I'm going to look for, there's a nice opening right here that I might want this vine to end. I got this one. To come down and just sit right here. Just sit right there. It'll be on it, you know. And then I have all my leaves. I cut some leaves so I can add them to the vine. And I think that's what I'm going to do. And then I might... I might put some of those red flowers in there. That would give it some oomph also. I could even put gold on them. A touch gold on them. Oh, see see what happens? Your mind your mind starts to wander and before you know it you're doing another Project. Yeah, I could do that. A little gold. Yeah, that would give it some color. I just might do that. So, uh, I'll get these three with a little bit of gold in the middle. And, you know, like I said, art is an adventure. So, we'll put those aside for right now. Let's uh, let's work on this. I don't want it too fat. So this is, I twisted two vines. I had two vines and I twisted them together. Whoops. I just took them and twist them together like so. And got all these straggly things out. So they're sticking out because I like them. They look like little grapevines, you know, and a little Italian. It looks good. I like it. An Italy look. That's what this reminds me of. It was an Italy look. So I love that. I love that. And I have, th I have little uh, leaves, tiny leaves that I can hot glue, Oops. hot glue onto them. So anyhow, we'll uh, cut that end off. I don't want it too straight down there, but we'll twist those more. And we'll figure this out. So I like this spot opened like that. So I'm thinking laying this vine on here and this down just a tad like that. Oh, that'll look so pretty, won't it? Should probably go up a little higher, like on the neck part. Mm hmm. Uh huh. That's what we're going to do. So let's get started before this video starts getting long. <laughs> so, I've, hot glue is ready. So, let's see. Let's see. Where's my spot again? Right here. So, I want it up here more and down. So I'm just going to glue this vine, put a little glue on it, and stick it. 
where I'd like to have it land. Right there. Right there. Let that dry. I think that's going to be pretty. That's going to be awesome. And then while that's sitting there, we're going to take our vine and bring it up here. I, I believe I want it up here because I have that other vine we could tangle up. Where do I want it down there? No, I don't think I want it right there. So I'm just going to put another dab of glue. Don't want too much because then you don't want to see that glue dot. Oh, yeah, we'll just glue that right up there. And I might just take this other vine down this way, attached to bring it. That might be too much. I don't know. Let's finish the one vine first. So we got that. And now I'm going to bring this over to here. Where do I want to cut that? I didn't know that. I might want to cut that. So I'm just going to dab a little glue on here to hold it. And I think I'm going to cut that off and add a Yeah, because it sticks out too far. I don't want it. I'm going to be gluing everything down. All, all of this is going to be down. And, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to glue it all down so it's hanging onto the glass and secure it more. Okay, so I got that. Now... I think that would look beautiful. But I'm going to have it come this way and down. Yep, that's what I'm going to have. I'm going to have that do. So I'm going to, all right, I'm going to stick it in to this vine so it will be hidden in there. Okay. So let me get that glue on to that end. And we're going to stick it right there and hold it. And then we're going to take this vine and come around, oops, hopefully, this way and up. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. And it won't stick, so I have to bend this a little more and twist it, twist it on that wire a little more, get it bend. And we might have to uh, just hold that glue on there till it really dries. Sometimes hot glues are just impatient. Not that I am. <laughs> I think that just looks beautiful. Oh, I just love it. I don't know. These are, these are so much fun. And could you imagine putting flowers in this? Beautiful flowers in this. Oh, 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 oh. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm, oops, it fell off already. All right, so we got to figure something out. I got to figure something out. Maybe if I put the glue on the glass itself and stick it. And hold it.
All right. Let me go around and put more glue all around this vine. Yeah, it's not sticking. I might have to just cut that piece off or something. I really like this though. It looks so pretty. You know what? I might just, because that might be too thick, that vine. I might just cut that off. And just use the thinner vine, thinner uh, My wood glue would probably do better. <laughs> I love that wood glue. And there's two wood glues that I use. Oh, yeah, that's not sticking. Just not sticking. Don't know why. The other's dead. The other's stick, stuck fine. Maybe this vine is just too thick. Oh. Cut more of it off. Cut that line right off. You know, just use these little stragglies. You know, these things here. And glue them on. That's what I'm going to do. If this doesn't stick one more time, then I'm going to stop the video and think of something else. Okay. Let's give that a try. Real life. Okay, so while that's drying, let's add some leaves to this. I want to glue this one, glue this down. So I'm just going to touch the leaves with it and lay it down. Just like that. Just like that. And I'm going to glue these leaves down up here and there. Just touch the leaf, the little glue. And that on your finger. Ow, that hurts. And lay it on. Yeah, that side cut right off. That's all right. I'm going to cut that right off. I don't want it. It's going to fall like that. Not worth it. Come on.
That might work. I hope. So we'll get these glued down. <laughs> that came right back up again. I guess we're just going to take that whole vine off. Yep. Just take her off. I think that looks beautiful. Doesn't that look pretty? Kind of wish I didn't get it on there, but I could take that off and move it. I do like it though. Yeah, I think I'm going to take it off of there. I don't care for it right on that. Uh, maybe I'll leave it. <laughs> Alrighty, let's try something else. If we can't um, have that vine on there, maybe I can just use this thinner vine by itself with the leaves on it. Right there. Yeah, up there. Let's make sure we have our leaves in the right direction. We'll scoot some on the leaf. Decide on where we want to put it. I think right there. I think right there. I like that. Yep, I like that a lot. Yep. We'll try and get this to stay on. Try it one more time. We'll hold this down and bend it in. Nope. I guess I'm going to cut that thick piece off. Just use the thinner.
Alrighty, now I think we're done with those. We'll save these little guys, these vines, and we'll stick some of them in there. You know, just throw the, some of those vines in. But right now, let's get some more leaves on it. We'll get some bigger ones to hide some of the mess that we have. Let's stick this guy right here. two big ones and then I'm just going to cut this little circle off keep the leaves together and we'll stick them one there and there and then the middle one that or the red flower hmm cut that right down Oh yeah, definitely, definitely, but I need another, I need one that has four instead of just the two leaves. Yeah, we'll try that. What do you think? Too much? I don't think so. I like it. Gives it little color. I'm going to get these down. Nope, I like it. Oops, get in the middle. Now I'm going to add some more leaves to this here. But I think I'm going to do little leaves. I like the, the little leaves. So we'll just cut these little leaves off. Put them on. Just glue the back of it a little and stick it on. Yep, just like that. Mm, we'll see if we can get some of these vines on there.
is on here. I think that's looking, that's looking pretty. I like it, I like it. And you can have it either way, with the flower showing or with just the green leaves. And I think I'm going to keep that the way it is. I don't think I want to put, do I want to put it? I'm just thinking of something else. See, this is what happens to me. <laughs> This is what happens to me. I start thinking of other things. I'm thinking I'm going to take this leaf there. Oh, there's more. This flower. And stick it in here somewhere. Just for color. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think? I'm just going to give it a little gold in it. Have it so it blends in a little bit more. I'm really liking it just the way it is, with more leaves. What do you think? Just a couple more leaves right there? Or do I want a flower in there? Hmm? Yeah, I might, I might just do that. I might just put flower in there. I might just do that. You know what they say. You don't get anywhere unless you try. You can always take it off. Always take it off, right? Got a little dot here that I want to put in there. Maybe. Yeah, I kind of like that. I'll put a couple more leaves in there. Maybe not. Maybe it looks just as good as it is. should be. Huh? Maybe one right here. Now, once I get this special spray put on, these will all be glossy.
the string from the glue just ugh. Alrighty. I'm gonna pause this and we'll be back in a minute. Okay? I'm gonna get this dried up and get my gloss. Be right back. Oh, okay. Now <laughs> we've got her done. Isn't that just beautiful? I think she's just beautiful. All right, I have a few things to tell you. I used clear glaze. It's a triple thick crystal. And I sprayed two coats on it. It'll help keep this shiny. And I might end up doing a little more. But... As I was saying, or going to say, we had put um, the frost on. Okay. When I put this on, it went clear. Well, no problem. No problem. I liked it clear, but I really liked the frost better. So, after it dried, I added more frost. Or, yeah, I added more frost to it. So... Isn't that just beautiful? I hope you went along and did it with me today or these videos that I've been doing and you learned a little bit of something and a lot of something <laughs> that it doesn't take much to create. Just get your imagination out and work it. Get the colors you enjoy. Get, uh, these are just from a vine I had in the living room. I cut and put them on. And these were from a rose uh, thing that I had. And I just took them and I bronzed them with paint and put them on. And this, of course, you saw what I had when I had a vine, which I just love that. Isn't that just gorgeous? Oh, I am so excited. I love it. I really do, but I hope you have enjoyed it, and it was something that you'll do yourself, and uh, enjoy. The inside came out nice. I love that. That the bottom, I finished that up, and made it all gold, and it made a nice, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And I don't mind that red. I think it gives it some pop. Really, it does. And I love this vine. Oh, it looks so pretty. So sexy. But anyhow, these are the vases. And I have more that I've got to do. And more classes to do. I do a lot of crafts. Christmas trees. Cone trees. <laughs> you just hit that like button. You share it. My videos. And subscribe. Make sure you subscribe. And hit the bell so you can get my next video that I'm going to do. And uh, I really would like a comment. A comment on any of this. What you like, what you don't like, what you'd like for me to do next. Um, I enjoy artwork. I have so much I could teach you. So please leave me a comment. I, I really, and I would get back to you as soon as I... Right away, really. So please leave me a comment, leave me a thumbs up, and enjoy the rest of your life. God bless. And I, I'd like to see pictures. If you've done one, send a picture in the comments so I could see your work. Artwork is just my thing. <laughs> so anyhow, see you in the next video. Don't know what it's going to be, so you better hit that like button, better hit that bell, and subscribe. Take care. God bless.